Hi, I'm Robin Higgins, and this is How Does Splitting a Nucleus Make Heat? So first we have to understand where energy comes from. So let's just think of having a campsite fire and burning some wood on it. And the reason that this makes heat is because when you burn wood, you're breaking bonds. And breaking those bonds cost you energy to put into them. So when you break them up, energy comes out. This is just kind of a fundamental thing we have to understand about chemistry. And the same thing applies to nucleuses. So it takes a lot of energy for protons and neutrons to all be bunched together and they're really held together tight and it takes a lot of energy to overcome to split them. But once you do, you're going to release a ton of energy. So the reason that you get energy by splitting apart a nucleus is because you are getting all of that energy that it took to form it in the first place, which was a lot. So let's look at how people do this in everyday life. Well, everyday life, nuclear physics. So the first thing that we do is take a uranium atom. And so uranium is radioactive. Uh, it's easily going to fall apart. And what you do is take a neutron. So I have it as my little blue dot right here. And at a really high speed, you shoot neutrons at this nucleus. And after a while, uranium, because it's kind of predisposed to do this, because it has too many neutrons in the first place, it will split apart like this. And when you split it apart, this is what creates all of the energy. So nice green for radioactive. This splitting creates tons and tons of heat and energy because all of the energy that it just used to keep it together is now exploding apart. And so when you have your nucleus split like this, you create two new atoms and you also create a bunch of flying off fast neutrons that are gonna go in other directions and they're going to go back to the beginning, they're gonna find another uranium atom and they're gonna split this apart again. And so this is called a chain reaction. By starting just one neutron shooting here, exploding this, you're creating now two neutrons in each reaction and they'll fly off and they'll find other uranium atoms. So this process is actually known as nuclear fission. And if you want to know how the chemistry all works, here is the chemical uh, reaction. First, we start with uranium. It's always uranium-235. It has too many neutrons. And you actually just take one more neutron and you cram it up, making a very, very, very unstable uranium-236. And when this splits, it always splits into xenon, a noble gas, and strontium. So you get these two things plus two neutrons, which uh, continue on to make your chain reaction. I'm Robin Higgins, and this has been How Does Splitting a Nucleus Make Heat? Mm -hmm.